Hello everyone. This is Orc Chief Gamer. In the light of the coronavirus, I voiced my concern over it, as well as offered some kind words to those infected. There's even been two confirmed cases here in Texas. Thankfully, I'm not going to be one of them. Now, another thing I said in my last video is that I would be sharing a few apps on your phone that could potentially help you if you want to stay home Or, if you want to go somewhere but you don't have a car or other means of transportation. Hmm. Anyway, how about I start with food delivery? Yes, the essential food, which people don't realize other people need, so they run to the grocery store and steal it before those less fortunate, or without a car, can. I have found a few apps for that, one of which I may consider using, provided it has access to the technology department. Walmart grocery shopping. You can't see it because my screen's bright, but that's what it is. Use pickup or delivery. Less shopping time, more family time. Reserve a time that works best for you. They have a new feature, which allows you to save time with added series screen shortcuts. Hmm. All your favorites at in-store prices. Each order is hand-picked with care. Fresh groceries and pantries Staples delivered. And they'll be in touch every step of the way. There was also my AGB app. Released before the virus, of course, this app allows you to get it from HEB. I'm not sure if there are HEBs anywhere else in the US other than Texas, but if your hometown has one, 
or your state has a few, then go ahead and use this. I guarantee you won't regret it. Of course, there are also other other services, like, for example, Instacart, a grocery delivery service I downloaded a few date a few weeks ago, but found out it doesn't cover Walmart. However, it does cover HEB. There are others as well, like shipped. Same day delivery. You need to pay for the same day delivery. But. <coughs> but. I wasn't going to do that, so I got rid of it. Any more corn fritters? Want some? I would, thank you. Hold on, let me move this out of the way. No, you're falling, you're out the door. Out, midnight. There's also Publix delivery, all the USA. There's a lot of delivery things. My favorite so far, and let's say we're moving on to fast food delivery now, is Uber Eats. Thank you. It's not an Orc Chef Cooker episode if I'm not eating something. And this is my grandfather's homemade corn fritters. I haven't eaten these in a long time, but they're delicious. Too bad I can't share the family recipes over YouTube. Oh. I don't know if I can. I'm gonna ask, but she says no, I'm not gonna share it. Anyway, back to it. Uber Eats. I have my own account for this one. Eh, I've already set my address in my videos a few times already. What you can do is use the filters on top to find something. You can also favorite things, like I did with McDonald's. Uh, like I did with McDonald's. So I could order from them. You also get deals with limited availability from Ooh. from uh, certain restaurants. Like for example, the subway on 3410 John Stockbrower Drive. Or, as I stated, McDonald's. They'll give you a zero dollar delivery fee if you spend at least 15 or 10 dollars 
in your order. Ten for Subway. Fifteen for McDonald's. And believe me, I've set up an order last night with them. That of course I wasn't able to buy because I don't have a lot of cash. But believe me, I would have. And believe me, I would be eating it on screen right now if I were able to afford it. Anyway. The way you find things in the app, there are categories you can choose from. The categories are... Hold on, I need to get a drink of hiccuping for some reason. I swear that stuff looks like blood. <clears throat> As I was saying, the top the categories are breakfast and brunch, fast food, pizza, sandwich, American, desserts, which I wish there were more options, salads, burgers, comfort food, traditional American, Mexican, coffee and tea, Latin American, deli, seafood, Italian, Southern, Asian, New Mexican, barbecue, New American, and Chinese. To be honest, I would have gone for Chinese either. Also, because I love sweet and sour chicken and spring egg rolls. You know my address if you want to send me anything. <laughs> Get out! Out! You're not welcome in here. Go! Damn cat. Oh, damn it, what am I doing?
Seriously? She's watching Repo Genetic Opera? <clears throat> Back to the apps. Of course, you know Amazon is being hit hard because of them signing something into power that affects the Postal Service. Now with Amazon you can get anything. Oh, damn it. Here's something I've been interested in. TV Robo Park Patrol. Now, when speaking of recording DS, I'm also going to be looking for things I can use to record my DS from my computer instead of with a capture card. If you guys know anything, please put it in the comments below, and hopefully, I can bring you some more DS recordings during the outbreak. Oh, this video is running kind of long. I typically shoot for 18 to 20 minutes, so if I find any more apps that I can hopefully convince you to use instead of going outside, I'm sure I'll be sure to post it in the part two or three. So, goodbye.